Hey guys, just in case you thought I dropped off the face of the earth, I haven't. I've been doing some things. I, this little plastic box I'm sort of designing to be a generator box. Uh, it is plastic, so, you know, generators do get hot. So, I put some exhaust fans on there. I'll give you a detailed look at that later because I've got one more piece coming in. But, uh, it could be an idea for a place to put my generator, sort of to camouflage it. Uh, so it won't get stolen because uh, in case you don't know it if you're using any type of generator You do want it outside of where you live if you keep it inside you've basically created a Quick gas chamber and you'll get your own personal death penalty for doing that. I got this sure can gas can this is a uh, This is a great gas can. Uh, I, I needed to get a good gas can. I've got a large gas can but like five gallons but this is this is a pretty cool trash can. You could just if I can get this cap off one-handed. It is pretty snug. There you go. You can just simply get over where you want to go and twist it down, basically. And gravity feed your gas out. Plus it has a uh, has basically a push button in here so you can release the gas. So it's just it's basically a very nice little system. You just have to unlock it here with your fingers and voila you can do it and since i'm going to be running some generators in the near future you know i don't want much gas spillage so that's a that's a good little addition uh sorry i've been busy uh doing a lot of working and like i say i'm moving and trying to thin out the junk and it's amazing how much junk you can gather over about a seven year period in an apartment and i'm trying to get out of this apartment etc where I'll be going, who knows, little house, uh, tiny house, uh, van for a little while, uh, we'll see, we'll see how it works. Uh, you know, as you get a little older and you start looking at retirement and you realize how much money you wasted, and God, I wish I thought it was three years ago, on, uh, on, on rent and et cetera, on, uh, an investment you'll never again regain, then you know, it's probably time to think about changing lifestyle. So, I'm going to be doing that and you're going to be seeing a little bit of that, I'm Considering spinning that off to another channel because all the other stuff on this channel remains the same. I've got tools to review. I've got a metal detecting video to edit that I'm going to be getting out soon. Haven't been doing too much. It's raining today, but now finally I think uh, I've got the, the allergy situation has lightened up a little bit. So we'll see how that does. So just want to let you guys know I haven't quit. Haven't quit going. But I have a lot of stuff to do. But I'm going to try to get out in some more videos. I got a lot of equipment. I want to show you some small equipment I'm going to need. I'm going to miniaturize my life. Hey guys, in addition, I did get this, uh, I guess using ancient terminology, it'd be called a hot plate from my cousin. It's an induction uh, induction hot plate, if that's what you would call it. Uh, so that'd be pretty cool. Uh, that'll be uh, pretty good in my future uh, shrunken down lifestyle. So, uh, I really appreciate that. Nice little deal for him to give me that. Uh, out of basically nowhere. Much appreciated. In any case, I want to show you this. And uh, that's probably all I'm going to show you right now. Uh, I'll still be working on that little uh, uh, generator box I showed you. Uh, right now, you see a lot, of, uh, a lot of Velcro on there. And when you're working with thin plastic, usually Velcro is more... Uh, logically used in screws since those screws would probably uh, break it or tear so we'll see how that works and I'll have one more addition to that and I will show you that tomorrow in it's uh, close to its final form maybe its final form anyway that's all I've got and I will see you tomorrow